This is Larry again with Marin Farm Mechanical. This is video two, 660 Massman Drive. This is the second clean out by halfway down the side of the building. I don't know what it is I'm pushing there. I can't tell if it's a wet wipe or toilet paper. Uh, looks like it's quite a bit of stuff <laughs> stuck inside this bike. Clay's in pretty good shape here. There's a lot of stuff getting left behind there. I'm ready to try to analyze these pipes on my way down. I'm waiting to do it on the way back. Trying to get a glimpse of it on the way down there. Now right there, feminine hygiene products, I'm pretty sure about the texture of it. If it was totally paid, we tore all the shreds where I ran a jetter through there a while ago. Alright, as far as I'm going to be able to get through this one. And right there is a paper towel. It kind of looks like a wet wipe. Another wet wipe. If it was totally tissue, it would be shredded up. I said, man, y'all fixing it? He said, I'm tired of walking on the other side of the building. You're the bathroom. I said, man, I think it's fixed. No, I can't vouch. <laughs> it's full of them uh, yeah. wet wipes. Or... That's what I told him. I said, I said, well, I said, what's wrong with it? I said, well, from what I'm hearing from my uncle today, it's, it's very old cast iron, and they can't handle feminine products and uh, wet wipes. Yeah, I've seen both of them here. More wet wash than anything. Whenever you got that, whenever you jet and you're pulling it back, you know, the toilet paper's gonna be shredded off pieces. When you find the sun, it's either gonna be wet wash or stiff paper towels or feminine hygiene devices. Most times you can tell once you get used to seeing them a lot. Oh. So how do you get those out? They, 
you can just knock them off the side of the pot. Eventually they'll wash out. Sometimes you have to gel them. I mean, it knocks them loose. Sometimes you have to take a sewing machine and get them. The belly area, but it's only like a half inch deep. I don't think it's nothing to worry about. It might just be a wet wife's holding that water back a little bit instead of the belly. It ain't too bad on sediment. Most sediment went out. I better shake the first half. And that concludes today's videos. Alright, the second part from there's a green door by the building. It's got a couple of no smoking signs on it. On the end of the building, there's a clean out right in front of that door. From there down, it's not in too bad a shape. I think uh, your vent and hygiene devices and your wet wipes are gonna be your biggest issue. Uh, you've got the one belly in the line. It's pretty, pretty, pretty bad belly, but I mean, I've seen worse. Uh, I think now that we know we've got it cleaned out, let's see what happens over the next few days. Need to make sure there's trash cans in the stalls. Little little trash cans, you know, for them to put those things in. Sometimes that's all it takes to eliminate the problem, man. I mean, if that doesn't work, then maybe a belly might have to be dug up and repaired. Thanks for your time.